Hey guys, it's Coach Allen here. Now I've told you before that basketball is the game of the feet, that every single thing you do on the court starts at your feet and you have to have great strength in your feet and mobility in your ankles. We've also talked about how important it is to protect your knees, not only for your explosiveness, but to keep you healthy and on the court. We've talked about how important it is to have mobility in your ankles and in your core so that you can move fluidly on the court. And, but in order to be a really great player, you have to have strong hands. You have to have strong, powerful hands to control the ball. Basketball is a game of the feet, but if you don't have strong hands, you'll never be able to play this game at a high level. I want to share with you two of my favorite grip and hand strengthening exercises. First one, I'm going to take two plates. Now you can use two and a halfs, you can use fives, or you can use tens, depending on your strength level. I'm going to take these two conventional barbell plates, and I'm going to put them face together so that the smooth sides are facing out. And I'm gonna simply take a pinch grip. So I've got my thumb on one hand, or thumb on one side, my four fingers on the other, and I'm gonna lift and pinch. And I'm gonna hold both of these plates together as tight as I can. You can see my forearm is fully engaged. My hand is fully engaged, working on a tremendous amount of grip strength. Now, after maybe 30 to 40 seconds, you'll feel the point at which you feel like these plates are gonna drop. You wanna make sure you do not drop them on your feet. You'll simply lower them to the ground or you can even do this seated. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop the plates there. The second of my favorite grip strengthening exercises is a one-arm hang, a one-arm hang. Now just to make sure that I'm not cheating, I'm gonna use the same arm that I just used there. So I'm gonna hold right here and all I'm gonna do is hang. I'm not attempting to do any type of pull-up. I'm just gonna let my feet out from under me and I'm just gonna hold. Tremendous amount of not only grip strength but shoulder strength and stability as well. Now this one, assuming you're not on too high of a bar, when your hand, and you can already see, when your hand cannot hold on anymore, you'll simply drop to the ground. If you were to integrate these two movements in, make sure we're using both hands equally into your strength work at least once a week, you'll see a, a real quick improvement in your hand and grip strength.